I prompted Meta's AI Studio characters to see if they're actually any good. So Meta just released AI Studio and it's brand new and I'm gonna give you a very quick first look. So jumping on over to the website, you can find this over at ai.meta.com. They have creator AIs, which are extensions of you, the creator. And they also have AI characters, which are based on interests. Today, we're gonna to take a look at a few AI characters. Once you log in, you can go to discover and here you can take a look at and browse through the different AI characters. It's not that easy to quickly browse and get a sense of everything they have to offer. So we're going to bounce around and explore and see if we can find any characters that are good, how useful are they, can they integrate into your personal and professional life. If that's something you're interested in seeing more of from me, make sure you subscribe. Okay, Skibbity, I'm gonna skip the toilet buddy here. Uh, Cupid, dating coach, let's go ahead and give that a shot. I've been married nearly 20 years. Let's see if I can get some dating advice for a date night out with my wife. Okay, I'd like to take my wife on a date for a few hours in, let's just say Napa, California. Let's see what we get. What I've learned by engaging with other AI characters is prompting is key. So what we get, Napa Valley is a perfect setting for a romantic date. What type of activities or experiences would you like to plan for your date? And they even give you ideas. Okay, first off, very promising. I like that it didn't just spit out an answer. It asked for more input so that it could give a more personalized recommendation. And I also like that it gave me some suggestions. We like wine tasting and art. Let's see what we get. All right, wine tasting and art. A match made in heaven. Napa Valley offers plenty of opportunities to combine both interests. So wine and painting night, that sounds fun. Art gallery and wine tasting such as the Napa Valley Art Gallery and Caldwell Snyder Gallery. I love that they're giving me real locations that I can research. A sculpture garden. I love that there's many ideas here. Okay, I actually like this one. This one is a pretty good AI character. Let's change topics and see if we could find something else. Going over to the Discover tab, let's search for workouts. Cool, so I've been working out and it can be difficult to always know what I should be doing in the gym and I would love to get some inspiration. Okay, so we've got Anna, your fitness coach, gym assistant, gym rat. Okay, there's not a lot to choose from, but let's go ahead and just choose this first one and it even says there's been 110 messages so maybe this one is at this current time a more popular option let's check out anna your fitness coach let's see i'd like a six day a week routine that mixes lifting and trail running I want to lose weight and gain muscle let's see if that works that's a pretty specific prompt because I've got a sense of what I'm looking for okay Monday chest and triceps Tuesday back and biceps Wednesday a rest day okay that's smart Thursday our legs Fridays, shoulders and abs. Okay, this totally 
and did not incorporate that much. It only did one trail running. Let's, I wanna try and tune this and see if we can get something like we did with the dating coach where it will listen. I'd like to alternate lifting and trail running days. Let's see if I get a better result. Okay, we've got Monday lifting, Tuesday trail running, Wednesday lifting, Thursday trail running, Friday lifting, trail running, and then a rest day. Okay, so what I like about this is that as I gave it more refinements in my prompts, I was getting a better result. The workout seemed fairly basic and what I would expect. It would be worth trying this character over the course of a month and seeing if you can get more variation in the workouts, letting it know what you like to do, what you don't like to do. So I'd say overall, my first impression of Anna, your fitness coach, is kind of middle of the road. I would need to test it more to see how useful it would be uh, in helping me reach my goals. Let's go back and try a few more. How about we check out one of these filters? Get advice and info, find interest, sharpen your skills. Let's try and sharpen your skills. We've got, oh, we got a chef, a car care guide. Maybe let's try the chef. I'd like, can you come up with a meal plan for the entire family. I have three kids and a wife who is gluten free. Let's see what we get. All right, I'd be happy to help with the meal plan. That's gluten free. Thank you for including that. Here's a sample meal plan. Monday, a gluten-free pizza night. Okay, that's great. Uh, Tuesday, Taco Tuesday, uh, gluten-free tacos. That's pretty easy to do a gluten-free meal. Let's see if we can get the ingredients. Can I get the recipes? Let's see what we get. It's one thing to get the meal ideas, but then to actually make them, that's another. Oh, wow, look at this. Okay, so the gluten-free pizza night. Here are all the details on making the crust. Here's how to do the taco seasoning, the chicken parmesan, the gluten-free pancakes. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, I would say this character is doing a really nice job. It's listening to my preferences. It's remembering about gluten-free. Not only will it give me a meal plan, but I can also ask for the recipes. That's awesome. Let's just type YouTube and see what we get. Okay, we've got unlocking AI secrets to one video at a time. One thing I'm feeling is that the search results, it's hard to tell which character is better than the other and what they are good at offering. Okay, let's just try this tube titan, optimize your YouTube for success. So what's your biggest struggle? How do I get more views? Okay, that's a struggle. Let's take a look at that. So get more views on your video requires a combination of strategies, optimize your time. Okay, that's all basics. Promote your videos on social media, that's basics. Um, let's see if we can ask a follow-up because this all seems pretty basic. Create videos that teach people how to integrate AI into their daily lives. Can you suggest some videos for me to make? So I gave it a sense of what type of videos I make so that maybe I'll get a better and more specific set of suggestions. Okay, here are some video ideas for teaching people how to integrate AI into their daily lives. 10 ways to use AI in your daily routine. Okay, 
showcase practical applications of AI, such as virtual assistants, smart home devices, AI powered apps, AI in healthcare, AI finance, how to change the way we manage money. Okay, not bad. These are some pretty good ideas. What's really interesting and what comes to mind, this is free for me to use Meta's AI Studio and I'm able to get some pretty good advice. Some of this advice I pay for with other AI subscriptions. So maybe what I need to follow up with is how good are free solutions versus paid? I think it's going to be murky over the next few months what you should pay for and what you can get for free. So overall, I feel like Meta's AI characters are pretty good. We found some good examples for AI dating, recipes for family meal planning, okay results with the gym. I'd say those were kind of middle of the road. So I think this is a pretty good start. And some of my past experiments, some of them were less quality. Some of them that we looked at today were higher quality. Do your due diligence, try them out. Try prompting, reprompting. If you're not getting the results you're looking for, maybe try moving on to another AI character to see if you get a better result. Also, time makes a big difference. Yeah, I might be getting really great suggestions today, but as I engage with these characters over weeks and months, am I constantly getting new ideas and suggestions or does it repeat the same ones over and over again? I definitely recommend you giving this a shot. Let me know in the comments what else you would like to learn when it comes to integrating AI into your personal and professional lives. And if you're interested, please consider subscribing. I'll see you in the next one.